After a multi-decade lull in research activity, LSD is experiencing a resurgence in scientific interest. One of the long-standing questions about LSD is whether it works as a standalone treatment. Most research has evaluated LSD in combination with psychotherapy, which makes it difficult to disentangle the effects of LSD itself from the effects of psychotherapy. A new trial published in JAMA is shedding some light on this question. But let's back up. LSD is still a Schedule I controlled substance, and it currently has no approved medical uses. But in 2024, the US FDA designated a form of LSD called MM120 as a breakthrough therapy for generalized anxiety disorder. The trial recently published in JAMA is a Phase II trial of MM120. It's a dosing trial that compared four different doses and placebo. This is the first trial looking at dose-dependent efficacy of LSD without psychotherapy. A bit about the trial. It was a double-blind, randomized trial conducted at 22 outpatient sites across the US, and it enrolled 198 adults. The participants received one dose of MM120 and then were followed for 12 weeks. The trial found that a single dose of MM120 did produce a dose-dependent reduction in anxiety, with the 100 microgram dose found to be optimal. This dose showed clinically meaningful reductions in anxiety with an effect size comparable to benzodiazepines. But unlike benzodiazepines, which work for hours, data suggests the effects of a single dose of MM120 could be sustained for months. Anxiety reductions were noticed within the first week after the dosing session and persisted through week 12. At 12 weeks, remission was achieved by 47% of participants in the 100 microgram group, compared to under 21% in the placebo group. Participants also showed significant improvements in depressive symptoms throughout the 12-week follow-up period. This study is preliminary. Stay tuned for the results of Phase 3 trials of MM120, which are already underway.